Hello everyone, I am Shyam Pasari and welcome to ASIN Academy. So as you can see from the title of this video, in this video we will solve another question on the topic of geometry and the question has appeared in the CAT 2004 exam. Now the question is as follows, a circle with radius 2 is placed against a right angle. Another smaller circle is also placed as shown in the adjoining figure. What is the radius of the smaller circle? Now we are provided four options for this question. Option A 3 minus 2 root 2, option B 4 minus 2 root 2, option C 7 minus 4 root 2 and option D 6 minus 4 root 2. So this was our question on the topic of geometry that has appeared in the CAT 2004 exam and I would like you to try this question first by yourself and then come to this video for the solution. I hope that I've tried the question and you've got the solution and if you didn't then let's check the solution. So according to our given question, we are given that a larger circle is placed against a right angle. So this is our circle and we are also given that a smaller circle is placed between the larger circle and this right angle. Now according to our given question, we have to find the radius of this smaller circle. Now to find the radius, we are given that the larger circle's radius is 2 cm. Now if we consider this point O as the center of the larger circle, then we can say that this distance and this distance is equal to the radius of the larger circle that is equal to 2. Now if we consider 2 as a capital R and the radius of the smaller circle as small r, then we can find out some relation between capital R and small r and then from that we will find out the value of the smaller radius. Now if we consider this point O and this point as A and if we join these two points then we will get a certain distance. Now we have to find out that what is this exact distance. Now from this point O to the center of the smaller circle is equal to capital R plus small r. Now we have to find the distance between the smaller circle to this point A. That value is equal to root 2 small r. Now how did we find out that value? Now if we zoom it a little bit, so let's draw a representation of that smaller part. Now this is a smaller circle and as we all can see that there is a gap in between and we have to find out this value as well to find out the actual value of small r. Now we have calculated the distance till here and that is equal to r plus small r and we have to finally calculate this distance. Now as I have said that is equal to root 2 small r. So let's find out how did we got it. So if we connect this point and this is equal to r, this distance is equal to r and since it is a square because this is 90 degree, this is 90 degree, this is 90 degree and this is 90 degree as given. So we have got this as a square. So we have got that this distance is equal to the diagonal of a square that is nothing but root 2a and for our case it is equal to r. So we have got this as root 2r. So the total length is equal to r plus small r plus root 2 small r. Now we can say that if the length of OA is r plus r plus root 2 small r then it is also equal to root 2 capital R because if we say these points are OA and these points are B and C then OB AC is a square because this is 90 degree, this is 90 degree, this is 90 degree according to a given question. So this is also 90 degree. So this becomes a square. So if this distance is equal to R, then the distance OA is equal to root 2 capital R. So you have got R plus R plus root 2 R is equal to root 2 R. Now by using this relation, we can find out the value of small r. So let's find out its value. So let's take all the variables containing small r in LHS and all the variables containing capital R in RHS. So you have got small r into 1 plus root 2 is equal to capital R into root 2 minus 1. So you have got the value of small r as r into root 2 minus 1 whole divided by root 2 plus 1. Now according to a given question, there was no capital R. We had taken the value of 2 as capital R. So let us replace it with 2. So we have got 2 into root 2 minus 1 whole divided by root 2 plus 1. Now to find out its exact value, let us rationalize the denominator. So we have got root 2 minus 1 in the numerator and root 2 minus 1 in the denominator as well. So final value is equal to 2 into root 2 minus 1 whole square whole divided by root 2 square minus 1 square. Now that is equal to 2 minus 1 that is equal to 1. So denominator is simply equal to 1. So we can simply remove it. So our final value is equal to 2 into 2 plus 1 minus 2 root 2 and upon calculation this is equal to 6 minus 4 root 2 which is equal to our option number D. So final value of the small r is equal to 6 minus 4 root 2 
which is the option number D according to our given question. That was all for this video and I hope that you understood all the topics covered in this video and if you have any doubt then you can post your doubts down in the comment section or you can send your doubts to us to our channel's official Instagram or Facebook page and we will surely solve your doubt as soon as possible. Or you can go to the official website of ASN Academy and you can send your doubts to us from there and all the links are provided down in the description. And if you did like the video then please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel ASN Academy. Oh, 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 oh,